As we mentioned earlier, the Western Ohio Aquatics League hosts a competitive swim season every summer in this area. It's a program largely run by volunteer parents. As Matt Finkel tells us in today's OIO in the Community segment, a pastor and his family are among those important volunteers. Go For hundreds of area kids, the summer is all about swimming. I've been swimming for a while, and my whole family does, and a lot of my friends do, so that's just fun. It's just a nice bonding time. Xavier is a member of the West Side Wave summer swim team in Lima. The girls and boys range in age from five years old to seniors in high school, and it's a family affair for the Bookers. My oldest son is 16, and he started swimming, swimming when he was seven, and uh, we've been at it ever since. Meets begin in June and conclude in the middle of July with the championship meet in Wapakoneta. Swimmers also practice five days a week, often with a morning and an evening session. So it's safe to say that the summer swim season would not be possible without the hard work of the parents. We can't run a meet without our parents. We need 50, 60 parents sometimes to run a meet. So we, we have to have them. It takes a whole lot of volunteers, uh, timers, runners, people to work the computer, um, starters, officials. Nobody here is getting paid. And so it's a labor of love. The Booker family has been a staple of the West Side swim team. Brian's duties also include announcing at the meets. It's a total team effort all around, including familiar faces who have graduated from team member to coach. I had swam previously here for seven years before I became a coach, and just the coaches have kind of, before me, have picked me out to take their place. I think I've done a good job modeling myself after them, and it's been really, really fun. With that type of commitment, the swimmers show great improvement in the water, and that's by far the most rewarding part of the program. It is fun. You know, I've done this enough years that I'm able to watch groups of kids kind of uh, uh, move forward together and to watch the improvement. You know, the little ones from the beginning of the season to the end of the season, that's fun. But over the years, I mean, I've watched some tremendous, tremendous swimmers. We have two state champions that are from this area. Taking the time to work with, it, work with them and then fix it, that is really worthwhile to coach the little kids. It's so cute to see them jump off the boards and do a belly flop, but then have to work on it the next day, and then they get all excited that they're not doing belly flops anymore. <laughs> Everyone's pitching in and the kids are thriving in the pool. So a real sense of community has developed at West Side Swim and Racquet Club. It's just fun, like we have swim buddies that like we have to get gifts for and they get gifts for us. I call it our swimming family. It's, it's there, we're a family, we're friends, we see each other all summer, we see each other all winter, and it, yeah, it's a tight-knit community. It's great to be a swim parent, it's great to, to help create this experience that our kids can have, and, 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 uh, and summer swim's supposed to be fun, so that's what we're doing. Reporting in Lima for Faith and Friends, I'm Matt Finkel.